Bruce Lee was the first powerful image of an Asian American. He had this magnetism and screen presence. When you saw him on the screen, it was hard for you to take your eyes off him. My name is Perry Lee. Started collecting Bruce Lee memorabilia back in 1967. My name is Jeff, I'm from San Francisco, and I have been collecting Bruce Lee memorabilia since 1972 at the age of 11. He was hip, he was cool, he was different. He knew how to dress, he knew how to dance. His scream and yell and his facial expression was really attached to Asian male. That drew people to him. This is a promo for the Green Hornet. He has very beautiful penmanship. Yeah, this is extremely rare, mainly because it's so fragile. Very few of these type of toys survive. This is a book that was written by Bruce Lee. And this is an example of one of his business cards. I think with every exhibit on Bruce Lee, it's always to show that he was more than a martial artist, that he was extremely multi-talented, inspired people by breaking these racial barriers. And to me, I think the most important thing about Bruce was that he brought people together. I could honestly say that Bruce Lee was kind of like my counselor. Whenever I got picked on, I would fall back on Bruce Lee because he made me feel proud.